Thanks, Kerry. Starting pitching is the strength of this White Sox team, even with the loss of Mark Burley. How is it going to be without a mentor like that in the locker next to you? Well, it'll be different. Uh, you know, I mean, this is this is my first year with a new manager, and you know, Mark's not here, but um, you know, I've. Uh, I've uh, picked up a lot of things from him. Eating up Burley's 200 plus innings will be Jake Peavy, who says he's 100% healthy, and Chris Sale. We're getting uh, an absolute stud in Chris Sale. Chris Sale is as good as anybody I've, I've, I want to say I've ever played with as far as just his raw physical talent. Having positive encouragement, you know, in the clubhouse, you know, and, that, and that's just, you know, there's team camaraderie. You know, we're all pulling from the same rope. We all got each other's backs, and we're all here to help each other. Well, I saw Sale. He looks great. I mean, he looks like he put on. A pound or two. So. <laughs> What's he up to now? Yeah, he's about 150 now. AJ caught over a thousand innings last year for the tenth consecutive season, the only active catcher to accomplish that feat, and he is not ready to give way to Tyler Flowers just yet. I don't think I have much left to prove. I think I've, you know, proven what I need to prove in this game, and um, I'll continue. I'll go out and do what I can this year. Uh, hopefully, play a lot and. You know, I'll play when they tell me to play. Well, we started out a little rough, but I mean, I mean, we have a good relationship now. You know, we talk every once in a while throughout the off season and stuff. We play a lot of video games together too, so we're bonded. We're all right. With the White Sox, Lou Canellis, Fox Chicago News.